Go the Distance goes off-road on Leif Erikson. Leif Erikson Road is great for riders wanting an easy route to try gravel riding or for anyone wanting to enjoy the beauty of Forest Park. It's a pretty easy route, but it's not flat. From Thurman Gate, it starts off with a 1.4 mile, 880 foot climb. It's a pretty gentle climb, averaging about 2% with a few little pitches at about 4% or so. After the initial climb, it's essentially flat for the next two miles. It's time to relax and enjoy the scenery. On Leif Erikson, you don't need a Garmin to know where you're at. There's a cement milepost every quarter mile. After about three and a half miles, there's a series of four long gentle rollers, each about a half mile to a mile long. You'll gain about 200 feet in this last stretch. If you want a challenge, you can ride up the fire lanes or a Saltzman Road. Just after mile six, it's time to turn around. So now everything's in reverse. About two and a half miles of descending rollers followed by two miles of flats. But after that, you get to enjoy a nice, comfortable, gentle 880 foot descent over the last mile and a half. Although a mountain bike will provide a smooth and sure ride, you don't need a mountain bike to ride Leif Erikson. A gravel bike works just fine, or even a road bike so long as you have wider tires, say 28 millimeters or wider. But with that said, you do see regular road bikes on Leif Erikson all the time. You just need to be sure of your bike handling skills in that case. The main thing to watch for on LEAF is the wide variety of other users. You'll see joggers, strollers, kids, and cyclists of all abilities. Please share LEAF Erickson gracefully. Thanks for watching.